Yeah, Jesus! 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 Here we are, sports fans. We are off ploughing. Our fast track is um, got the knob box on the front, got the dowels, all the DP7 on the back. So, yeah, done a oh, sort of half day's ploughing with it, uh, where HS Ag had spread the muck, and uh, yeah, touch wood, all went well. All went well. Um, one thing I did have a problem with is one of the uh, fittings that goes onto the changeover valve had split. One of them fittings just there. Uh, but I got my old mate Darren, um, whose uh, you know, his company is DB Transport, does um, hydraulic hose and all that sort of stuff. And he come out, um, fitted all new hoses to it. Um, some on the um, front uh, front fire adjustment there, because they were all pretty poorly. So he's fitted all new pipes on there for me. So uh, shouldn't be any problems with that. So got the hydraulic top link on, um, which means because obviously I'm still struggling with I haven't got any brown spools at the minute until um, we organised with Russell Fast Tracks to come over and put his. Uh, new spool valve controls on then I'll get all three spools back but as as then um, I'll just set the uh, the front fire width to what I want it basically in when I have it ploughing and then just unplug it and then put the top link back in and then you've got um, obviously top link control but uh, Wi-Fi rear lights so that you've got you know some mark lights on the back and I do have a, a rear flash on as well all magnetic so they just um, they just stick on wherever you want them lot I did think about uh, at some point I'll make it just a bit of metal just to bolt onto the rear thrower there just so these lights are a bit wider apart but I mean, blimey, you get the idea dynamic indicators as well so it's not too tricky to figure out, is it? So we'll turn these off, put these in cab. Right, just close up the front furrow adjustment on her like that, because that's how we want it for ploughing. I can now swap it back over for um, the top link. Right, you see I've pulled a few uh, furrows out of here, just sort of like into the middle of the thing. Well, what have we done that to us? Well, we had to make a little bit of a pond here with the mucky. Um, and it's going to be interesting to <laughs> get this any, anything like level. I have to do a, a lot of ploughing one way. So we've got a bit of a heap here and we've got a little of a, a bit of a dip there. You can see why I ploughed it out just to lose a bit of uh, liquid like. But that looks, still looks a bit soft in there. So we may just have to avoid that a little bit like. This is where the mucky was and this was like the lowest point and it was just draining down the track a little bit so we had to contain it. But, uh, Richard has gone through this with a flat lift just to break it up but this will yeah, this won't be very nice when it turns over will it? I 
I've had reports um, <coughs> that there is various wasps nests in here, especially by one of these posts. We put posts up to warn people that there's um, sort of muck here. Yeah, see those? And it was, uh, basically said it was um, laying where a wasp nest was. So there's the odd one or two floating about, but I think we'll be all right. Oh, shit. Excuse the language. Can you see? <laughs> I knew I didn't pick that up. Hmm. We will leave that well alone for a minute because they're wasps. And wasps are stripy bastards, aren't they? Don't want an excuse to. Um, uh, to uh, blooming stingy them things don't so what we might do yeah I don't know do we risk it do I pick it up and chuck it because at least I'll be able to I want to plough this bit eventually don't I oh we'll go for it we'll go for it hold on I'll set you up it might be interesting to watch I'm going to put you on and I'm gonna set you down. Set you down here. Ugh. So there's no one here to track me as I run away. <laughs> that sit steady, hold on. Oh, it's gonna be fraught with a bit of danger, but we're gonna plan is lift up and launch, and then possibly leg it with you. There's a few just, yeah, floating around at the minute. But there's a good... Oh, I mean, it's not huge, there's about 50 there, roughly. But 50 wasps is plenty. Right, let's give it a go. I'm gonna be gentle. Come in from the blind side. They might not know what's hit them. Yeah, Jesus! 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 <laughs> Jesus! Yeah, Jesus! They're after me! Ah! Ah! Jesus! Jesus! Get in there quick! Get in there quick! Get in there quick! Oh. Oh. Yeah, you mother oh. Die, you bastard! Oh. Go on, Couple of times, maybe. Just there. I say they went for the jugular. Oh. There's no more on me, is there? Oh, it's gonna sting. It's stinging now. Yeah, they didn't like it, did they? As soon as I picked it up, they were buzzing. It's gonna be a painful day. <laughs> oh well, that's the fun for the morning. It's got the adrenaline levels pumping. Got me neck hurting. Time to do some ploughing. <laughs> <laughs> 